Hi everybody! Today we are going to demo how we make creating Hive tables simpler. We start by downloading a list of banks. This bank is available as CSV. CSV is just comma separated value. Then we open up you and goes in the file browser. We already uploaded two versions of the bank list. One with the header, one without header. This is the header. And this is our data. We now go in the Hive Meta Store app and create a new table from a file. Specify the name of the table, then the input file. We start with the bank list without a header. You will detect the format. And then propose you the list of columns. We can manually copy paste the column names. You could also type them one by one, or just copy paste them. And that's it. We recently made you even smarter. If the data file contains the headers, we'll detect it, and then prefill all the columns for you. You are free to revert it by just clicking on this button. The column detection type is also better. It will detect if the column is a string, an int, or a float. Et voilà, here is our new table, and here is the data. Hmm, our data doesn't look correct. The column seems off. This is because Hive doesn't support coded CSV, meaning some fields can have double quotes at the beginning of the end of the field. The solution to this is to use the custom CRD. The native lazy CRD doesn't escape this. We use the CSV CRD on this GitHub website. Then we go to the Hive editor, just upload the CRD, add it as a jar, and tell Hive to use another CRD for our bank table. And that's it! If we go back to the table browser, we see that the CRD changed, and now our data looks correct. Et voilà! Now you can import even more data into you and analyze it. Thank you for watching, and see you at the next episode!